Boom! What's up, my name is Geeks, Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in today's video, we are going to talk about SoFi, ticket symbol S-O-F-I. Uh, this is a fintech uh, company that we've covered here on the channel. I currently own the stock and there's been some movement in the stock and we watched today, there's been uh, a pop in the stock. So I wanted to cover that and then we'll talk about where we see this thing uh, moving forward. Uh, before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So when it comes to SoFi, again, this is a company that I've talked about here. Um, the, their product base from a fintech standpoint, they are getting into pretty much everything from loans to refinancing, uh, just to money management, investing. Uh, so they have this holistic picture of your money and they are getting into insurance. So pretty much everything banking, which is one of the things that we're going to talk about um, today. So I love the company. I love where they're going. As a matter of fact, again I do own uh, the stock I own uh, an account with them and so uh, just for just for transparency I'm an affiliate with them so if you want to check out SoFi I'm gonna put the links in the description below so you can definitely go go check them out uh, so use that link and then you probably get like 10 bucks or 15 bucks for signing up um, so when it comes to SoFi if you look at the product base here so you can invest in SoFi you have personal loans that you can apply for you have student loans that you can refinance uh, you can can do so far money management you can do home loans credit card private student loans insurance credit card and other loan refinancing the one thing that you don't see on here right now is their banking uh, because right now what's happening with so far is that uh, just from a, a loaning standpoint they have to deal with license from all 50 states they have to address license in all 50 states so the 50 states have different laws they have to worry about that so um, they are so moving into applying to get a license to operate as a bank I, at that point that they're going to kind of streamline their operation because they're going to be regulated by uh, the FDIC, the OCC. And so things are going to get a lot easier for them instead of dealing with 50 different state uh, regulations. Now they only get to deal with uh, the Federal Reserve, the FDIC and the OCC. So to me, that is a, a, a path that once they get to that point, you're going to see them operate even more efficiently. And they recently just hired um, somebody that's going to come in. I think Galileo, uh, that's a guy's name, to come in and help them in setting up that banking part of their business. So I think uh, once this goes through, once they get approved, you're going to see this stock uh, start making some really good moves. So if we take a look at the news here, um, analysts at uh, Jeffries actually initiated a buy call for SoFi. And, and so they are looking at uh, a price target about $25. So this is this is crazy. Um, again, if we can switch over here to CNBC, uh, same thing. So looking at search um, more than 60%. So uh, again, um, I've always told you guys that this thing to me, when it got down to $15, it was always a buy more in that zone because um, if you look at it, of that around that fifteen dollars is always being support for 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 SoFi. So I like that uh, fifteen dollar price point. If you can buy there, keep buying. Again, this is for a long term. If you just want to swing it, um, I would say it's you might wait a little bit and see if there's a little pullback before you can jump in. I don't like buying right now when the thing is running um, to the upside. You want to be in it when it's running, not when uh, it, it is already running. So for people that are looking to jump in, I will say if you take that risk, put a really tight stop. But if you're looking to buy long term, wait for a pullback. This thing is going to come back again to you. Wait for that pullback and, and start to load up. Um, so we just look at the chart here. You can see here uh, it opened up today at about fifteen dollars and some change, and then it has squeezed up. We've seen a high today of about uh, sixteen eighty, uh, which is I mean again that's about a dollar. Uh, let's see, right, a dollar fifty-four for a spread. So I think um, so far for people that traded it today, I mean, you should be in the money, which is which is awesome. So again, just a recap here. Uh, the reason why so far is popping today is because 
um, Jeffries, um, analysts at Jeffries actually initiated a buy call with a price target of $25. And so when people see that, when Wall Street see that, they get excited. That's where the stock jumped. But I'm also looking bigger picture here, not just focusing on uh, the short term here. I'm looking at bigger picture here. The big picture here is that so far is really establishing himself and they're moving to the point where they've hired somebody that's going to come in and take them to that next level, which is actually uh, applying for a banking license. And the fact that they're hiring somebody that has the expertise, that tells me that they're confident that they're going to get the license to operate as a bank. And if they do that, um, it's going to streamline the business because they're going to go uh, from being regulated by 50 states um, as far as their lending and their loans go to now being regulated by mainly three authorities, the Federal Reserve, the FDIC and the OCC, which is going to make things a lot easier for SoFi as a company. And also the one other thing that you should be aware of that by being a bank, SoFi will be able to hold more loans on its balance sheet. Uh, and at this point, they currently have or a limit as to well, how, how much loan they can hold on the balance sheet. But once they become a bank, that goes away. Again, gives them more opportunities. I like that uh, coming from SoFi. Again, guys, this is something that I want you to be aware of. Um, this is a long-term play for me. Uh, I look at the dips and I buy the dips and I continue to build that position. If you look in the swing, it's always good to buy when it hits those levels, the support. That's where you jump in. And then if it's if spike, you take some profit. If you're swinging, um, I hate jumping into a swing trade when the stock is already moving. So if, you're, if your idea here is just to get in and make some quick profit, I'll probably say pump the brakes. Don't do it again. That's my personal take here because uh, based on my experience, that's always you can this thing can reverse tomorrow. You have no idea or it can even pop. But don't just do it because uh, you're following momentum. Do it because you understand the fundamentals. If this thing is trading uh, right at support, you look at support. You see, hey, each time you hit support, it bounces back. Then you can start loading up uh, off of that support. Uh, but then if it's already bounced already. Um, if you go in, get a really, really tight uh, stop loss. That way you don't lose money um, in the trade. And even if you lose money, you really minimize your losses. So that's something I want you to be aware of. So again, let me know in the comment section what you think about this. Are you currently in so far? Do you plan on getting in? Are you swinging? Are you long uh, term holding? Uh, what's your strategy? Again, let me know in the comment section. If you're new here, we talk about how to earn money, save money, invest and build wealth. If that's something that interests you, Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. Also, guys, if you're looking to get started with investing, Weibo has their promotion where if you sign up, you get free stocks. SoFi has promotions to where if you sign up um, for the SoFi money or SoFi invest, uh, SoFi crypto, you get free stocks. I put both of those links in the description below. And as always, guys, do your due diligence. Don't be a greedy savage. Stay motivated. Uh -huh.